two students halls of residence at Manchester Metropolitan University have been locked down following a coronavirus outbreak. A total 127 students have tested positive at the Burley campus and Cambridge halls, and a number of others were symptomatic, a statement said. As a result, all students in the two halls are being told to self-isolate for 14 days immediately, a joint statement said on Friday night. The University, Manchester City Council and Public Health England jointly made the decision to order students into quarantine after detecting a spike of COVID-19 in accommodation blocks. The Manchester Evening News reported semicolon last weekend that a number of students were already self-isolating at the Burley campus after a 100-strong party was reported in the courtyard. Medical, welfare and well-being support would be put in place for the quarantining students, the institution said. Have you been affected by this story? Email webnews at mirror.co.uk Public Health Director for Manchester David Reagan said, An important part of Manchester's local response and prevention plan for coronavirus is to keep a close eye on their data and act swiftly and decisively where an outbreak is identified in order to contain the virus. That's what we've done here. It comes amid a tough week for students around the UK, with warnings those already on campuses could be ordered to spend Christmas there or away from family back home. Authorities have ordered students in Scotland not to go to pubs this weekend after major outbreaks on campuses. Hundreds living in student halls have been forced to self-isolate after two significant coronavirus clusters at the University of Glasgow this week. The university said 124 students had tested positive for coronavirus resulting in more than 600 being told to isolate, but they suspect the actual number is likely to be higher. Secretary Matt Hancock has not ruled out asking students to stay in their halls and flats over the Christmas period. The warnings sparked anguish among students and their families, the St. told of returning to university believing they were required in lectures instead of sticking to online learning. Sir Mark Walport, a member of the Scientific Advisory Group for Emergencies, SAGE, said this week the measures may be necessary to avoid spreading the virus back to their home communities 